Welcome back guys. Today we are going to see how to dilute aminophilin in neonates and newborns which have been delivered as a premature. Aminophilin is used for maturity of lungs after birth when the baby is premature and then when the baby is in the womb and the mother is going into premature labor they give dexamethasone. They give a menophilin loading dose of 6 mg per kilogram body weight and then maintenance of 2.5 mg per kilogram body weight. So how do we dilute a menophilin? So the preparation is they prepare one ampule is equal to 250 mg in, in 10 ml. So now, we are going to use 40 ml to dilute this drug before aspirating and giving. So we are going to use the ratio of 1 to 4 ml. So we are going to get... We are going to get 1 ml of aminophilin and then we are going to add 4 ml of water for injection so in total it will give us 5 ml so this is a diluted aminophilin and this one the total is 25 milligram in 5 ml So if you want to dilute the whole thing, you will aspirate the whole ampule. You are going to aspirate 40 ml of water for injection. And then you are going to Aspirate 10 ml, then aspirate 10 ml of aminophilin. That will be the all. So the total thing will give 40 plus 10, it will give us to 50 ml. So this one we are going to give IV. So now, to dilute the oral aminophilin, oral aminophilin, this one the baby will be discharged and go home, will continue with oral. What we are going to do, we are going to use distilled water, distilled water and aminophilin. In one ampule of 250 milligram in 10 ml. It is the same. What we are going to do, we are going to aspirate, aspirate 40, 40 ml of distilled water. Then aspirate the 10 ml of aminophilin. So in total, 40 ml plus 10 ml, we are going to get 50 ml of aminophilin. So this one we are going to give it orally. And aminophilin will be given up to 34 weeks of gestation. Though the baby is still is out, we are going to keep the baby. If the mother delivered at 30 weeks, the baby is going to continue up to 34 weeks. So let's put for example 
the baby is delivered at four weeks. So the first week out will be counted at 31 weeks. The second week will be 32 weeks until going to continue like that though the baby is outside. So in summary, amenophilin is given to prematures and the milligram is given 6 milligram per kilogram body weight, loading dose and then the maintenance dose is 2.5 milligram. So it is uh, prepared in 250 milligram of one ampule which contain 10 mils. So to dilute it, we use the ratio 1 to 4. You can aspirate one mils of amenophilin and then you add one mils of water for injection to make five mils. So in this five mils, the whole thing is 25 milligram. Then for in for the all ampules, if you want to make for the all ampules, you can make it 40 mils of water for injection and then you aspirate 10 mils of amenophilin, which means in total will give us 50 mils. So, and then we come and look about oral amenophilin. Oral amenophilin is given when the baby has, is being discharged because the, baby, the mother cannot continue with oral, with IV, because the mother will not continue with IV treatment or they will not be discharge the child with cannula at home. So, they are going to give oral amenophilin that is diluted with distilled water then one ampule of 10 of 10 mils of 25 250 mils of amenophilin is added to 40 mils of distilled water giving us the total of 40 mils giving us the total of 50 mils so they say that menophilin is given up to 34 weeks of gestation. They continue counting though the baby is delivered before term. So that is all. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.